Pretty hey everybody, Big J, Anderson Mountain View Farms. We have got the, our new goat. Her name is Zelia. And that's uh, short for an African tree, by the way. And we've got TB and Lil here. Hi. Getting ready to milk her. Say she is a big girl. So they've already cleaned, um, cleaned the udders. And they are, she's going to go ahead and start milking right here. And you can tell she really gives a lot of milk. So we're very happy about that. Um, so you can just, so you can kind of see how they do it. Uh, so TB, explain exactly how you milk the goat as opposed to what people think you do. Well, most people think you just do it like this. But when you do that, you really just aggravate the goat, tend to aggravate the goat, and you don't get any milk out of it. So what you do is you pull it like this, and you push it like this. Right. Fingers Look. around the tea, and you use your other fingers to squeeze the milk out. Good job. So you can see, and this, this, this gal, she really produces a lot. Um, and this is, I think, her second fresh thing. We, we just purchased her. So she's so cute. Look at her. We give them a good mix of grain and feed, and uh, she definitely likes that. So, yeah, look at her. She's cute with the big fluffy ears. Yeah, with the big ears. Yes. So, very beautiful goat. Um, these, these Nubians here are technically also raised as uh, show goats. Um, but they are definitely uh, attractive goats, and they do... A a great job and the girls here what they do is they'll they'll swap out they've already milked uh, Ambila and you can see her she'll massage the udder there um, to be able to get the more uh, milk out it's very similar to the way it is with a human if a mother is uh, breastfeeding uh, mother will oftentimes do the same thing to release more milk down for a baby so you kind of do the same thing if you've ever watched a kid uh, suck from a goat, um, they will do that. They'll take their nose and they'll go up there just like what she's doing to help get the milk to come down. So we're definitely very thankful. It's an exciting, uh, exciting process. And um, in our next uh, next few episodes, we'll be going through the um, uh, making the uh, the grits and the cornbread that we were talking about last week. So we we'll, were we'll using the whey from the goat milk uh, or, or some that has been made recently. And um, hope to see y'all here soon. Uh, the fall is, is coming up, beautiful time. And like us on Facebook, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and we'll see you next time.